Good morning, Tenney students. I'm Alyssa. I'm Marissa. And this is Tiger, Tiger News. I heard March Madness is this month. I remember reading The Library Lion. And I remember reading Panda Problem. Look at all those trees. Speaking of trees, I heard there was going to be a news article coming out on tapping trees at the Tenney. Well, anyways, moving on to weather with Caroline. Weather and some exciting events for this week. First up with the weather, it's finally starting to get a bit warmer, but it will be cloudy, windy, and a little rainy. There will be a high of 61 this week and a low of 31, and there's a 50% chance of rain on Friday. And Thursday will be the warmest day of the week, with a high of 61. And as this week goes on, the sun will start setting even later every day at around 6.50. This means that the total daylight is increasing to almost 12 hours. Spring is on the way. And we also switched the clocks forward yesterday, so we lost an hour of sleep. But at least the days will be longer, and spring is coming. Have a cloudy week, Caroline. Thank you, Caroline, for the weather report. I can't believe we're finally going back into the 50s this week. I can't believe we lost an hour of sleep. I know. I woke up and I was so tired. I want to go right back to bed. Anyways, now on with Iowa sports. Hey, what is up, Tenny Tigers? It's your girl, Aya, back again with another Tiger News video. Before I begin, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and hit that post notification bell so you can be notified every time we make a new video. Now, let's move on. As most of us already know, it's the month of March, my favorite month, and you want to know why? It's because it's March Madness. Who's excited? I know I am. If you don't know what March Madness is, let me give you the rundown. March Madness is where 68 U.S. colleges compete to see who, who the best of the best is. Unfortunately, there are no teams in the competition from Massachusetts, but it's all right. There's always next year. Also, huge congrats to the Yukon Huskies for winning March Madness last year. The first round will be starting on Thursday, March 21st, and the schedule will be out as soon as possible. So be on the lookout for that. Anywho, that's all I got for you guys today. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week, and this is Aya signing off. ka -ching. Thank you, Aya, for the sports segment. Anyways, now on to Alyssa with school news. Hey guys, it's me, Alyssa Machado, back again with school news. I'm sorry for not posting yesterday. It's because we've been busy with March Madness. Go check it out. Anyways, this week at the Tenney, we have a few important events. Starting off with Ms. Goyette, Officer Smith, Mr. Hill, and grade level counselors will be visiting classrooms of grades K-2 this week. They have also been boarding buses and reminding all students about how important it is to follow all bus rules and that riding the bus is a privilege and not a right. Make sure to be respectful and mindful while riding the bus. By the way, good luck to all the fourth graders. I heard your biography showcases this Friday. I remember doing that back in my days. I was Sandra Day O'Connor. I ate and left no crumbs. I practically ate the whole plate if you think about it. Remember, our school is still seeking girls in grades three to fifth who would like to be a part of Girls on the Run. This program runs after school and begins on March 31st through June 1st. It will be on Mondays and Wednesdays from 3.15 to 4.45. Also, a little birdie told me that there's going to be a book fair on March 25th, all the way to March 29th. It will be during wind block, but your families are welcome to join in on the fun and shop after school on Wednesday, the 27th, from 4 p.m. till 7 p.m. Also, this Thursday there will be a yearbook meeting from 3 to 4. Lastly, the 17th annual Boston Bruins PJ Drive is coming to an end. Make sure to donate new PJs by Friday. Their goal is to collect 200 pairs of PJs, so let's make it happen. Anywho, that's all the upcoming news, Tenny students. I'll see you again next week. Alyssa Machado, signing off. Capiche? Oh my gosh, that was rough. Thank you, Alyssa, for school news. Oh my gosh, did you hear about the future freshman night next Wednesday? Yeah, are you going? Yeah, do you know what time it is? Uh, 6 p.m. That's good. That's all the upcoming news, Tenny students. We'll see you again next week. Bye. Bye.